This is the CBS Evening News with Russ Mitchell. Good evening. Russ Mitchell is off tonight. I'm Sarah Brody. Over the past decade, the number of arrests in the United States has increased by half a million. In response, a new company is claiming to be America's first urgent legal dispatch, promising help in 15 minutes or less. Andrew Sorensen reports. Daniel Herman is 18 years old and loves playing music. He's off to college in the fall, plans which were almost sidelined by a drug arrest. My friends and I decided to go smoke a joint on the sidewalk, which was a bad decision in retrospect. Then there was an undercover cop parked across the intersection behind another parked car, watching us the entire time, and there was nowhere for us to run, so the cop just came out and came up to us. He was handcuffed, taken to jail, and had a lawyer within an hour. According to the new legal company, Lawyer Up, people ages 16 to 20 are more than twice as likely to get arrested as they are to crash a car. Lawyer Up is marketing to kids just like Daniel. Kids don't understand the system. Police understand that this exists and they take advantage of it. Dean Noble, co-founder of Lawyer Up, says young people tend to misunderstand the judicial process. Police are allowed to lie to you, to do anything they can to try and get information from you to incriminate you. The game changer here is really the faster you get an attorney, the less time the police have to make a case for themselves against you. Lawyer Up says that they can get you a lawyer in about as much time as it takes to deliver a pizza to your house. They've even developed a smartphone application so that you can do it with the push of a button. But some are still skeptical that you can deliver quality legal services in that short amount of time. I think it's unrealistic ever to believe that a lawyer is going to be working on your case within 15 minutes. John Coffey, kind of professor of criminal law at Columbia University, foresees some unintended repercussions for the clientele. A judge at sentencing or a judge at intake may know that this guy coming from this lawyer up group was someone retained on a kind of anonymous basis in advance because this person foresaw that he might get in trouble. While having a lawyer on call can act as an immediate solution, it may not benefit the client in the long run. Daniel Herman also has his reservations about the new legal service. In my situation, it probably wouldn't have helped me. The company is hoping to expand nationally. Andrew Sorensen, CBS News, New York. Despite skepticism, after only one month, LawyerUp has 700 new clients in three states. Thanks for tuning in. I'm Sarah Brody, CBS News, New York. Good night.